Hey there, it's Jessica with Fantabulosity, and surprise, I have a Stitch Fix unboxing for you. So I got an email the other day saying they'd waive the styling fee if I scheduled a fix. And I ask you all on my Facebook page, if you don't follow me on Facebook, I'll put it down here below. It's Fantabulosity Blog. Uh, I asked you all on Facebook if I should do it, and the majority of you said yes. Go for it. Actually, I think almost, I think every single one of you said yes. <laughs> so, I'm going to give it a shot. I don't have anything to lose. If I don't like anything, I can send it back. The only stinky part is if I do like something, I don't get to use the excuse of, oh, but I can put the, you know, the styling credit towards it. I don't have that this time since I didn't pay for one. <laughs> so, we will see how it goes. All right, so it has been quite a while since I've gotten a stitch fix shipment. Um, the reason I stopped is because I just wasn't, it wasn't even exciting anymore. The stuff they were sending just wasn't, I don't know, it wasn't for me. So I've been doing a lot, so I've been doing a lot of trunk clubs and this last one that I did. If you haven't watched that last trunk club, watch it. I freaking fell in love with so much of it. All right, so as always, they sent the prepaid envelope to send anything back that I don't want to keep, which is always really nice. And then this little envelope looks a little thick. Oh, hello, it says. Oh, there's a little note. Then I see the name at the bottom says Erica. I don't know if I ever had an Erica or not. I mean, it's been a while, like probably over a year. So this may be a whole new stylist. Happy fix day, Jessica. I hope this fix finds you well. We wanted to thank you again for giving us another chance to style you. I read through your profile, checked out your new pins, and found a few pieces I hope you love for those early morning drop-offs. Oh, good. Okay, so what I did when I went ahead and scheduled this fix, I said I would love a couple of quick, casual outfits that I can throw on in the early mornings to take my kid to school. And I don't really, you know, I know if I'm not careful, I'm going to be wearing my pajamas in the car, <laughs> dropping him off. So I would, I told her I would love like some, uh, start thinking about fall. So maybe some jeans and maybe some casual, cute little t-shirts that I can just throw on real easy and not have to worry too much about it. Oh, that's prices. So I'm anxious to see what she packed. Okay. So love a Pella. I get that brand in trunk club. That's cool. I wonder if that's a Nordstrom brand. All right. So love a Pella. It's a black top. Uh, it looks like a three quarter sleeve. Yes, maybe uh, a long short sleeve. Maybe I don't know. So it's a very simple top. The back has cutouts though. So like this is a cutout and this is a cutout and this is a cutout. So I'd have to wear something underneath it. Maybe unless I want to show my back, but I don't really want to do that. Um, so it's okay. It's the Leander cutout back swing knit top black and a small okay small petite i think sp so it's cute it's kind of like hmm. i mean it's it's pretty simple which i told her i would like simple you know but uh i don't know and we'll see how much that is in just a second now this is a floral top the brand of this brand is q a grayson ruffle overlay tank top off white and small that's cute i could probably layer a cardigan over that um, so she got the ruffle and she got the floral. I'm not totally in love with the pattern, but it may look cute on. I don't know. I don't know. Let's see about that one. All right. This is Daniel Rain. Oh, I remember that brand from the old Stitch Fixes. They used to send a lot of that. Uh, so it's floral. So, okay. I've been telling, even on Trunk Club and, and Stitch Fix, I say floral but I think I need to say I'm super picky about my florals. So some of this floral is just not me. Like this, not so much. And the one right before this, not so much. So the floral, I'm super picky about floral. I just need to be more detailed, I think. I may actually like the color of this on uh, more so than I do like on the hanger or out, fresh out of the box. Uh, the coral is a color that I typically love. But I'm not totally in love with this. Okay. And this t-shirt top is, the brand is Good Hyuman, H-Y-O-U Man, M-A-N, Human, but maybe it accentuates the U, I don't know. Uh, it says, it's all good. Mm, that's not really me. That's something I normally wear. The color's pretty, but it's a t-shirt. Mm, so far, not in love. <laughs> And then some jeans cut from the cloth. I do love cut from the cloth. And I don't think I have any jeans this color. So that's kind of nice. These are uh, Dana Distress Skinny Jean. 
I would like a light wash like that. And I do like distressed, so that's good. And just a regular skinny hem jean. So those are, those are a maybe. I do have a pair similar to this though, I think, now that I think about it. So I don't even know if that's gonna be worth keeping. Okay, so that's the last item. Now, let's look at the prices. As you can tell, I'm not totally blown away. <laughs> uh, the jeans are $88. I'll have to see those on to see if I really want those or not. Uh, the Love Appella is the cutout black, oh, back swing top. The very first top is 54. The Daniel Rain, like the coral with the flowers, is $64. The Grace and Ruffle Overlay Tank Top. Yeah, okay, so the Q&A Grace and Ruffle Overlay Tank Top, this is $54. The, the like the aqua colored t-shirt is 44. So if you buy all five, you get 25% off. Oh, it says $20 credit. So I wonder if you do get a $20 credit if you don't, if you get a free style. Huh, maybe you do. Maybe that's what that means if you have a coupon for free style. You can still take $20 off. That'd be good to know. Okay, so I'm definitely not buying all five, but uh, if I do get to take the $20 off of the jeans, that would mean they were $68. And I'd want, I wanna try them on to see if they fit, but Okay, so again, I'm not totally in love at all, like not excited about that. <laughs> um, but with them on, it may make a big difference. So let me know what you think. I'm gonna try these on and see if they fit, see if they look cute, and I'll let you know. Okay, so here is one of the tops that I got in this fix. It's the kind of coral, floral, sleeveless top by Daniel Rain. And then I've also put on the cut from the cloth jeans that she sent. Yeah, I'm not even excited about the jeans. So I think it's a personal preference. I don't really like light wash jeans. I wanna give them a chance and the benefit of the doubt because I love the way that they look off, uh, off of me and rather on the hanger. But for some reason, I just think since this is like the biggest part of my body, I feel like it accents that, and I really like dark wash jeans the best. So this is a couple of the items that she sent, and I'm not totally in love with either. So I'm gonna go put a different top on, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I've paired this top with just some dark distressed jeans that I have, and I like it better on than I did just fresh out of the box. The only thing is, is that I am I'm on the shorter side, so when I wear tops like this, I think it seems to make me look shorter and squattier, unless I pair it with heels. So I do have a pair of nude wedges that I could wear with this that would really, I think it would look good with this, and it would also help, I don't know, make me look a little bit taller with this type of top. It just kind of cuts into my midsection and makes me look squattier. So uh, I'm not in total love with it, Honestly, I'm probably not going to keep it because I think it's one of those that I would always hesitate when I look in the closet for it. So I have to be in love with it if I want to spend that much money on something. So I'm probably going to send this one back. But as always, let me know what you think about this one. And I'm going to put on the aqua colored t-shirt next. And then I have the black one. And that's it. I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm not even sure what to say about this one. <laughs> First, I'm not, this isn't me at all. Like the little saying there. I do love wearing shirts that have sayings on them, but... It's just, it's hard to read, it's small. And this is just so not flattering. It's not fitted, it's just kind of hangs there. It's shorter than what I normally wear. I'm looking in my mirror if you're wondering what I'm leaning this way for. But the V-neck is weird. It's not like a V-neck, it's like a half scoop, half V, and it almost looks like a scrub top. I'm not kidding. Or like a sh old shirt that's worn out that I've had since I've been in high school. <laughs> so I'm definitely not keeping this one. Uh, and then the last shirt I have is the black top that has like the cutouts in the back. So I'll be right back. Okay, so this is the very last top. It's the black kind of three-quarter sleeve top that has the open cutout in the back. You can see my bra. I did leave, a, I didn't put a cami underneath it because I wanted you to be able to see the cutouts. So if I were to keep this, I'd probably wear a shirt underneath it, but then it would kind of take away from the cutout too. So I would just make sure you have a black bra on if you wear something like this, I suppose. But again, it does not wow me. It's not flattering. It's not, it's just kind of baggy. It's just, <laughs> it's just kind of, so anyway, uh, that was it. I'm not keeping 
anything. But I would still love to hear what you think about it. Maybe I'm completely wrong about some of it. Um, so let me know in the comments below. I can't wait to hear from you to see what you think. And you may be asking yourself, well, I wonder if she's going to do another stitch fix. Probably not. Guys, I've heard from so many of you that you stopped watching my trunk club videos because you prefer stitch fix videos, but I'm just not, when I have to pay 20 bucks to receive a box full of stuff that I don't like or don't want, I don't want to keep doing it. It's just not, it's not fun. So I'm probably not going to do this again. I hate that because I would love to keep doing stitch fix, but I don't think I will. All right, guys, thanks so much for watching. If you want to watch more fashion videos, you can head over to my blog at fantabulosity.com and click on the fashion and beauty tab and you'll see everything right there. All right, guys, have a great day. Bye.